The Sinobatum blue is the world's smallest butterfly and it's about the size of an average thumbnail. And it was first discovered in the 70s and then it was um, unstudied by science for about 20, 30 years when somebody from Nottingham carried out his PhD on the butterfly. And then we have been monitoring it ever since because it's critically endangered. This is a thyme plant. It's the only plant that the caterpillar feeds on and it's what the adult butterfly prefers to feed on. We're basically, we're just looking for flowers and signs of sepals or buds so we can compare it between years to see the flowering times and like between all the patches as well. This plant has lots of big sepals, so we're going to score it as a 1 on our phenology system, which is a scale of 0 to 7 to assess the flowering status of our plant. taking some water so we can water a sample of plants um, from the patches um, and we're hoping to see the effects of watering on the plants. I'm very happy that I'm in Jabal Musa, so the best place is for us. I love the place, it's natural. فبنحب أكثر مع الفراشة عشان في أصغر فراشة موجودة في العالم فاحنا سعداء طبعا ناسا um, he's been a great guide he's been helping us um, do the butterfly transacts and he's provided invaluable knowledge about the plants and where the, he's found additional habitats additional patches of time that nobody knew about which has been invalu invaluable to the work Predators to the Sinobatum blue, they include lizards, and which is the main threat, and also some birds, some spiders, and some praying mantis also have been found to prey upon the Sinobatum blue. هي مش مرغوبة عند المعيز ولا عند الجمل ولا عند الحمار هي كنبات عادية ما بيحبوهاش تقريبا كمان يعني يمكن يأكل منها حتى صغيرة ما يأكلهاش تاني بس هي عشان فيها علاج وفيها طعم مر جامد عشان هي في علاج للبرد برضو وهي نادرة جدا برضو عندنا وإحنا بنحب النباتة وإحنا بنزعل لما حد مثلا يشيل النباتة أو يطفها وهي خضرة أو كذا يعني 